If you do any kind of teaching for kids, you'll know the dread of standing in front of the class and not being able to reach them. It could just be the time of day or external factors, maybe even the subject. But wouldn't it be good to have an ace in your pocket? Something you could pull out to encourage engagement and active learning. Keep watching and I'll show you how to create worksheets in Canva that make learning fun and help kids develop a sense of mastery. Hi, I'm Nadia, the design lead for education here at Canva. If you've been teaching for a while, you know how effective worksheets can be for building and cementing knowledge. They can encourage both exploration of new topics and revision of old ones. Whether you're teaching vocabulary, writing, science, math, well, anything really, worksheets provide a chance to practice and achieve a sense of mastery for your students. And let's be honest, they change up the delivery, giving you a chance to really observe the class and see where you're needed most. By the end of this tutorial, you'll know how to create fun and engaging worksheets, make them accessible in different formats, share directly to your students, and how to collaborate on worksheets with your colleagues. Okay, that's a great question and thankfully easy to answer. At Canva, we love a good template. We think of it as starting inspired. Then with the simple drag and drop tools, it's simple to modify, dramatically cutting down your prep time. Let me show you how. From the home page, type in worksheets. There are thousands here. From basic coloring worksheets to more complex topics and exercises. There are even workbooks with multiple pages. One of these could set you up for weeks. Now remember, when you're searching for a template, everything can be adapted to your students' needs. Don't like the color? That's easily changed. Want different imagery? Easy. Canva has an element library in the millions. Look, it's probably better if I just show you. I'll start with this template. Hit this button and it'll open in a new tab. You can see there are three pages here. One in black and white and one with the answers. So you can show that at the end. Now, as I mentioned, everything is adaptable. Change the colors like this. Hit the change all button here to speed things up. Change the fonts here. Again, you can use the change all button. If this illustration isn't representative of your students, change it. Select it and hit the info button here. You can hit the see more like this and that will show you a bunch in a similar style. Or you could choose to view more from the creator by clicking here. Wow, there are lots of good ones here. This has a handy search function so you can pinpoint your needs. Click the three dots and you can star them for later. Isn't it easy and quick? There are so many talented creators who are teachers just like you, constantly uploading and updating worksheets and other templates to help you in your classroom. Now let's get this into your students' hands. If you want to print this out, just go to the share menu and download. For the best resolution printing, make sure you select the PDF print option when downloading. Oh, and don't keep it single-sided. Save paper and put another worksheet on the back. This will download the file to your desktop and you can send that to print. More and more classroom resources are becoming available digitally and worksheets are part of that movement too. To share this with your class, you can go here to template link. This will provide a link you can send to your students. This is what they'll see when they click on it. By clicking here, they will get their very own version to start filling out. With this example, they can just drag and drop the answers into the correct areas. When they're finished, they can share their work with you here or just send back a view only link so you can quickly jump in and check. The possibilities are endless with Canva. You'll never hand out a boring worksheet to your students again. What's your comment or question? Drop it below or just let me know what type of worksheet you're planning to make. Okay, while I have your attention, have you checked out Canva's channel yet? 
Explore an array of content, including expert tips from our team here at Canva. Whether you're a design newbie or a total veteran, you're bound to learn something to elevate your designs. Subscribe to our channel so that you don't miss a beat. We publish weekly. Oh, and this one was popular with teachers. Back to worksheets. One of the best things about Canva is the collaboration. We get it, you're busy, and collaborating face-to-face -face can be time-consuming. Canva makes it easy to work with other educators with our practical share features on the editor toolbar. Let's have a look how. Click on the share button, enter their email here, and decide whether to give them a view only commenting or complete editing access. After logging into their own Canva accounts, they can view and edit the worksheets on their computer, phone or tablet device, enabling you to work together at the same time from wherever you are. I love that you can see the cursors moving around. It stops you from working on the same thing. If asynchronous is more your thing, leave comments for your colleagues and assign tasks by adding their name like this. They'll get a notification in Canva as well as an email informing them that there is a comment assigned to them. It's a great way to share resources and share the load of creating them. I dare your kids to fall asleep with an awesome worksheet like this in their hands. And I can see parents suddenly being very interested in helping their kids when homework time rolls around. Got a question about anything in today's tutorial? Pop it below and the Canva team will get back to you ASAP. Oh, hello, you're still here. Well, if you're looking for more inspo, check out the playlist. It's full of tutorials that'll teach you all sorts of aspects of Canva. If you subscribe, you'll be notified every time a new video drops. Actually, now that I think about it, this video would go well with the one you just watched. But really, the best way to learn is just by jumping in and trying it yourself. I can't wait to see what you create.